Hello, everybody. Welcome to Thursday night at Raincross Farms Makery. We are glad you are here. Come on in to our craft room. My name's Robin, and you can't see him, but you might hear him. Behind the computer, behind the camera is my husband, Bill. And we are coming to you just outside of Lewiston, Idaho. And like I said, we love to craft. We love to share our crafts with you, give you some ideas, give you some inspiration show you how you also can create beautiful do-it-yourself home decor items. So that's that's all about us. So when you are hopping on, if you see the red box up here that says live, you're watching us live. If it's not there, you're watching the replay. And we would certainly appreciate it if you would comment hashtag replay if you're watching the replay. And if you're live, say hello to us and let us know what's going on with you. And I'm about to sneeze. Ken's got a little pushy. He just sent me a message that says, where are you? We're right Man, here, Ken. Ken. Where are you, Ken? Holy, holy. <laughs> let me pull this up on my phone. Ooh, a picture of the cookies. Okay, where is it? There it is. So... Hello, everybody. Say hi. Let us know you're out there. We can see some eyeballs, but we don't have names attached to them. Okay, my nose is running. I, I don't know if you saw my post earlier on my personal page. I am having the worst allergies. I had them last year at this same time. And, excuse me. And I thought maybe it was because we had a, we kind of had a drought last year. I thought, well, maybe that's why everything's dry and the pollen's out there. Well, we have had the wettest spring on in, in a whole lot of years, so that's not the problem because my allergies are back. Anyway, I'm fighting through it, so if you'll just, you'll just pardon me if I'm sniffling or if my eyes start to water or get red. So I'm, I'm open to your suggestions. I am taking, uh, I've been to the doctor, I'm doing what he said, uh, nose spray, allergy pills, honey, local honey, all kinds of things, hasn't touched it. So if you have any, if any suggestions out there, okay, if you are watching, of course you're watching, because I wouldn't. said he found us. Well, I'm glad we, I'm glad, because we were lost. Anyway, if you are if you are used to watching lives, you know this helps out video creators. If you will love our video, if you will follow our page, if you'll share our video out to your page, uh, to some friends that you think might be interested, or if you're a part of any craft groups, we would sure appreciate the, the, the little push out of our live video. And of course, our stars are activated, so we appreciate any of your support for any of those things. Okay, we are going to do a, a, a simple craft and I wanna show you how simple it is. And I want you to be thinking about if you could do it also. So I just yesterday, I am my own club member. So just yesterday I got my club subscription packet in the mail and you can join club so let's open it up and let me show you what's in it so i get one of these every month i also i've already i've already seen this design because because i'm a designer so i get uh, i get a little early access to it but this is the actual kit that could come to your house so you get this envelope and you get another envelope an envelope inside an envelope and in here is an exclusive design and this month this is this is June's exclusive transfer it's a quote from a poem by Ralph Waldo Emerson live in the sunshine swim the sea drink the wild air and we've we've done this a couple of times I'm going to show you another way that you can do this and this is like the simplest easiest thing but this isn't all you get you need you need some paste to go with it so Club members also get a, a three-pack of coordinated 
pastes that that go along with this with this transfer. So the colors this month are, and these are enough to do a couple of little projects. Okay, so you get the couture teal. See the color up there, teal, guava, which is a uh, kind of a peachy, peachy orangey pink and shimmer harvest so these are the three colors that come with that come with the the club packet this month so we're going to actually use these colors i'm going to save my packets because i actually have jars of the color so i'm going to save these for another project or maybe a giveaway or something so i have my guava my shimmer harvest and my couture teal so that's what we're going to design this with Okay, who am I missing? Yes, Ken, why are you not in the club? <laughs> we would love to have you in the club. Don't you have somebody you could give a gift subscription to for the club? That would be good too. Hey, Patty, welcome. Okay, so we're going to do this design. I'm actually going to save this transfer too because I already have the one I got earlier and I've already used it. So we'll keep this one as brand new. Now what we have done, what we have done this on, let me review the projects we did. We did this one. Uh, back here is a um, artist canvas and we did a watercolor technique and then we just chalked in black this design right over the top and then we stuck it in a frame. So that was our the first one we did. Then we did it a little we did it a little bit different and we did this piece with some wood cutouts and we separated it, it kind of gave it a nautical beachy look again same transfer a couple different ways so we're going to do it we're going to do one more and I'm going to use you saw the little uh the little intro when you when you logged on, I said I'm going to do it on my very favorite surface, and this this is my very favorite surface. This is our Aiden board. This is a nine by twelve, and I love this board. If you if you were to join club, I would absolutely recommend that you get one of these boards, and then every month you have a surface that you can you can use your transfer on. Because this was April's, March's or April's club. And I chalked it on here. And I'm kind of done with it. So I'm going to take this off. I'm going to show you how easy it is to reuse this. So I invested in this frame, but I can reuse it over and over and over. I'm not stuck with this design. If I, if I get tired of it or if I want to change it up, I can do it. So we're going to put this transfer on. What I like about this board is that it's magnetic, because look at here. I put, we made, we made these little cutouts, we chalked this on paper, and we put some magnets on it, and this is a magnetic board. So that's pretty awesome. So I'm gonna show you how we can reuse this. Let me set those aside. Use those on something else. And so I've, we've actually got, I don't know if you can see, we chopped in black, black paste down here. We wanted it to be tone on tone because we wanted to know where to place the, the little magnets. So there's actually paste down here too, along with this top. So if we want to redo it, this is a non-porous chalkboard surface. I'm just gonna take water is what I did on our paste. I used our paste, which is semi-permanent, water-soluble, non-toxic. It's chalk in the form of paste. So I'm just going to dampen it again so that it gets, so that it kind of rehydrates. I'm just gonna let it sit for a minute and I'm going to need a paper towel. Okay, so say hello if you're watching. Let me know if you have fun plans for the weekend. We are actually going camping. So 
after we get off this live, we're going to be finishing packing up the trailer. We're going to go just camping for the weekend with the church group. So that's what we have planned. What do you have planned for this weekend? I've let this, I've let this kind of sit. Now I'm going to take my paste scraper. If you didn't have one of these, you could use like a, a gift card or a credit card, the side of it, or a plastic spatula you might have in the kitchen, nothing metal. And I'm just going to take this and I'm going to scrape that paste off. Now the plastic scraper doesn't hurt the surface as long as you're not trying to gouge it in there. But I'm just scraping off that layer of paste. So that I can reach off this surface. Okay, so I've got that scraped off. I'm going to take my paper towel and I'm going to pick up all of this scrape, paste scrapings. And it's pretty clean, but there's a couple of spots where I still can kind of see the letters. We call that ghosting. So now I'm going to take my board eraser and I'm going to get it, dampen it. And I'm going to just put just a tiny bit of elbow grease. This board eraser does most of the work. It's like a magic eraser, but there aren't any chemicals in it. For this surface, it doesn't so much matter if there's chemicals, but we definitely don't want to use chemicals on our transfers. Hey, Fran, welcome. Don and I are going to Big Bear. You do that, you do that a lot. Do you have a place up there? Or do you just, is there just a place you go? Well, you have a lot of fun. Okay, so a paper towel again, just to dry this off. And my surface now is completely, completely clear. And I am ready to put a new design on it. Is that not, is that not the coolest thing? I don't have to decide, well, where am I going to store this? And I, you know, I really didn't like it that much in the first place, or I'm ready for a change. I, I can reuse this surface. That's just awesome. Again, this is our Aiden board and it is nine by 12. It's bigger than that, but the opening is nine by 12. So we are going to use, and I'm checking, it doesn't really matter which side is up, but I'm going to kind of Put it put that side up and i get a transfer out again i have used this before so it is not as sticky as when it was brand new but i am going to fuzz it just a bit so our transfers are reusable i've already used this three or four times already and i'm going to continue to use it you can the company guarantees that you can get 10 to 12 uses out of these but i happen to know if you take good care of these and clean them up really well pretty quickly after you use it you can use it 20 times more more than that yeah, i know that the surface is magnetic but uh -huh. is it two-sided this the, the board no no yeah. that is actually like corrugated uh plasticky sign that is is an extra layer holding this holding this in But no, it is not two-sided. So a little bit of fuzz just to reduce the stickiness. Because when I go to pull it up, I don't want to, I don't want to stretch my transfer. Now this is, like I said, 9 by 12. So this is going to fit right in there so I can. I can center it pretty easily because it is just the right size. I'm pushing down to make sure I have no air bubbles underneath here. Okay, and we are going to use, again, Quava, Shimmer Harvest, and Couture Teal. Hi, Becky. Welcome, I'm glad you're here. So my club members, have you gotten your transfers? 
gotten this transfer. It should have come in the last day or two. We're just going to kind of alternate around off. I'm going to do, I'm going to start with the Shimmer Harvest, and then I'm going to go to the Guava, and then I'm going to go to the Teal. And we're going to do a Paste and Peel method, which I'll show you in just a moment. So let me make sure my paste is all ready. Again, this is chalk in paste form. And sometimes when they sit for a while, especially the shimmers, they might need to be stirred up just a little bit. That one's ready. My guava. Got a little stir. Check the consistency. It should be the consistency of sour cream or pudding or Greek yogurt. You don't want it too thin, you don't want it too thick. And a teal. Okay, I think we are good to go. So let's start at the top and work our way down. Shimmer Harvest, I love our shimmers. I put a little bit of paste on my on my squeegee. I'm using the mini squeegee. Covering that screen. These are silk screens, fine mesh screen. And our paste dries pretty quickly, and I don't want it to dry in the screen. But I'm going to tell you, the shimmers take a, you get a little extra time working with the shimmers because they dry a little more slowly. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to chalk this next line in our guava. And then we're going to peel it up, part of it, just to make sure that paste doesn't dry in the screen. Pretty easy, simple stuff, right? Okay, so I've pasted, now I'm gonna peel just what I have chalked so far. I'm gonna stop right there. I'm gonna hit it with my dryer. Now the paste is firmly affixed on the surface now. If I had let it dry in the screen, when I peeled up the screen, I'd peel up the paste. But I didn't give it a chance to dry. So it stays where it needs to stay. And I'm just going to, I'm not going to push that down. I'm just going to lay that down. We'll push where I still need to chalk. So we're going to do swim in our teal. Now hard to see because that's the same color as our transfer background. So Club, let me tell you a little bit more about Club. It's an awesome program. If you have seen, if you have seen, not maybe not just me, but other people who have, who have, who do chalking lives and you're interested and it sounds like you want to try it, this is a great way to get your feet wet. Okay, and again, I'm going to peel that up. Just where I chalked and I'm going to dry it. It, it's it's very affordable and it's a fun way to to get started. Um, it's $19.99 a month, and again you get the transfer and the three paste packets. And that that um, the club envelope has free shipping, so you don't pay for any shipping for your club packet, which is awesome. So it's $19.99 a month. Okay, now I'm going to switch back up to our Shimmer Harvest. There's other perks. Uh, the company itself, Chalk Couture, um, very often, maybe not every month, but very often offers special deals just for club members. Um, sometimes it has been 
free shipping on all other products. Um, again, the, the, the club subscription is shipped free, but if you purchase other things from the website, you get that. I'm going to go straight to the guava wall because that won't dry. Um, if you buy other things off, off the website, you get $5.99 flat rate shipping, which is a great bargain. Shipping, shipping prices keep going up and up, so it's great to get flat rate shipping. But once in a while, the, 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 the incentive for club members might be free shipping or it might be special, um, special prices on transfers or just special deals. And in addition to what the company provides their club members, I also have special deals and special gifts and special giveaways for my club members. So it's a great, it's a great bargain. Every month, I try to show you three or four different ways you can use the transfer. So you can always refer to those live videos that I do, or I try to post them in my VIP group, sometimes here. So you get some ideas how you can use the transfer. Okay, so we're almost done. Okay, so I'm going to go to teal for the wild air. Kind of clumpy. I'm going to have to do some work with that paste. And then I'm going to do the gold on these lines. And you know what? I think I'm just going to finish this up instead of peeling it right now. But we will. Give our credit to our author, Ralph Waldo Emerson. Him chalked in there. And I've got paste all over my fingers, so I'm going to clean them off. I don't want to get paste everywhere. Hey, Cheryl, you're here. You haven't been here for a while. I'm hoping everything's okay. Hoping your, was it, daughter-in-law is doing better. Okay, so all done here. Let's peel that off. Woohoo! Very pretty. I like those colors. And I didn't have to choose the colors. The experts at Chalk do their research and find out what colors are popular, what colors are trending. And they make those decisions for club members. Okay, so let me clean up just for a second. And I might actually, let's see, let me see what I do here. Okay, so that's all done. Well, we are glad to hear, I, and I like the color scheme too. So like I, like I showed you, we've done it a couple different ways. We did a multicolored background with just black paste. Now we're doing the black background with just with the multicolored paste. And then before we went completely off script and, and did it in some blues. So I'm just going to give that a chance to dry. So you saw how this was something completely different when we started, and I was able to change it all up. And we're still going to do a little more embellishment on it. So I'm going to let that, I'm going to set that aside to let it dry. I'm going to show you how to clean our transfer. For those of you that might be new, 
I want to show you how it's done. Super, super easy. The easiest way is to take it to your sink and like put it on a, you can lay it down in the bottom of the sink or you could, I, I put mine on a plastic cutting board and just run cool water over it, but I'm not going to go do that. So I'm going to show you how I can just clean it up right here on the fly. So I just sprayed it with water. Remember our paste is water soluble. I'm going to start with either a paper towel or I like to use these Swedish dishcloths. And I'm just using this to take off that initial, as much of that paste as I can to start with. It will make the rest of the cleanup a lot easier. Okay. If this was a paper towel, I'd throw it away, but it's reusable, so I'm going to reuse it. And next, I'm going to get my board eraser back. These are magical when cleaning out your screens. I highly recommend you get these. Some things I will tell you, you don't, this is not a magical towel. It, it just is in our colors and it's got a little chalk couture label. Uh, but you could just use any towel. You could use your t-shirt. But these things you really need. You really need board eraser to get your, to get your screen nice and clean. Because this comes in. I don't know what it's made out of, but it grabs that paste out of the screen. Now you can still see I've got some paste in it. It's because it's now on the back. I'm going to turn this over and spray it again. And I'm going to go over this side with my board eraser. Now I also have some of that fuzz. Remember at the very beginning, I fuzzed my transfer so it wasn't so sticky. So I want to make sure I get all of that off also so it doesn't build up. And my goal is to get that screen clean. So my screen is clean. You see a little bit of staining. That's because of the pigments in our paste are, are very strong. So it's going to stain this green part, but that doesn't matter. That doesn't affect how this, the silk screen works. So as long as you have the paste out of the silk screen, you are good to go. So I'm going to set this aside and it's kind of not sticky now that it's wet, but when it dries, that stickiness will reappear. I'm going to let that air dry and I will put it back on its backer sheet and put it away in its plastic sleeve and it's ready for another day. Okay, so let's see what we can do to dress this up. I had a couple of ideas. I think maybe just because it says the word sea, sunshine, sea, makes me think beach or nautical. Now, we've done, we've done one that's nautical in the blues. But I had some ideas for dressing this up. And I thought, well, you know, if I could do a bow, I thought, well, maybe I could do a bow out of rope. So let's, let's just play around with this. I don't have, which is longer, this one's longer. I don't have a ton of this. So it's gonna have to be a, Kind of a smallish bow. Okay. So I could put a bow up top with nautical rope, or I also have this nautical rope, which I could do a bow out of. Tell me what, tell me if, if you like one of these more than the other. So, like the natural look yeah, the white doesn't really show up. Yeah. Okay, so do we like the net? Do we like the the natural looking jute rope? Okay, so I could put that up there, and I can put it on with a magnet. And then I got, I found these at Walmart, and I splurged and I bought a whole container of seashells because I don't live that close to the ocean. So I bought some seashells and I thought maybe we could put, maybe we could put some here and there, here and there on our surface. Now I could, I'm 
this opens. I guess it, I guess this whole lid lifts off. Ken's vote is for the Jute. Okay, Ken votes for Jute. Anybody else have a vote? Okay, so it comes off like that. I'm going to set this aside. And I've got some gold. Gold. I don't know what that driftwood. Driftwood. I've got oh I've got a I've got a star a gold starfish. What else do I have? Oh, I have one of those. Now I could just glue it to the frame. Great big one of those. Oh, what else do I have? Kinds of fun stuff. I should have picked through this earlier. Okay, lots of these little, I don't know what they're called. Another gold one. That there. Okay. What are we thinking? Does this look any good? Ken says he likes the shelf. He's got jars of them. Do you? Yeah, that doesn't Thanks. Uh, yeah, where were you when I was yeah. when I was at uh, Walmart? Walmart. Okay. Let's I think see. one time we had some shelves at our place too. No, I I know we did. I'm sure we thought we are not packing these and taking these to. You know what I could do? I could paint some of these these colors. Could I do that? I like the natural look. You like the natural? I do. I like okay. the natural look. Now I do have a question for you on if you glue that to the frame, is that going to ruin the frame to where well, you can't use it in the future? I it might. It's kind of a it's not it's kind of a purposely distressed frame anyway. It's kind of sanded down and you can see some black underneath. So I could lightly glue it down. And even if I pulled it up and it pulled up a little bit of paint, I could either touch it up with paint, I could repaint the whole thing, or it, it might just look fine. I don't, I don't like that driftwood. Another one of these, maybe? Maybe another one of those. How's that? Does that look good? I like it. Do we like it? Okay. I don't know that I put any around it. Else okay. At the bottom. okay. So I could put them, I could glue magnets to these and put them on the surface, but this kind of fills up the surface. So I'm just going to glue it onto the frame. Okay. And I'm going to glue that up in that corner. Does it look good? Show me, show me some hearts. If you like what you see, show me some hearts if you like what you see, and then I will glue it down. Some fuzz. Jute fuzz. Some hearts. Those aren't just mine. They're okay. Oh, lots hearts. of hearts. Lots of hugs. <laughs> Hugging hearts. Okay, so I think maybe you guys like what you see. So, and then in a week or two, we'll try to peel off the shells and see what they do. See if I've ruined the, the frame. I definitely haven't ruined the frame. Probably I can... Giving you some hearts. Too. Thank you. Some, some hearts in the comments. Thanks. Um, I'm not worried about ruining the frame. The worst, worst case scenario is when I go to pull it up... <laughs> Um, I pull up some of the paint and I have to look good sniffles. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks for that, Ken. <laughs> That's how I, I talked to her, too. You know what? Um, her eyes don't look as bad as they did yesterday. Yesterday they were just so red. It was, it was worse mm -hmm. yesterday, but maybe yeah. some of that uh, stuff is helping. Maybe. I don't know. I'm taking so much stuff. I don't know. Okay. Anyway, what, as I was saying, before I was so rudely interrupted, 
Um, the worst case is I've got some glue that, that doesn't come off or I pull up some paint, but I can always repaint this because that's just like a chalk paint. So I'm really not worried. But again, like I said, this is my favorite surface. You sell it in the shop. It's perfect for because the club transfers are always eight and a half by 11, so this will fit any of them. Let's see. So anybody who decides to join club, I would highly recommend that you invest in this frame also. And then when you get your when you get your transfer, you are good to go. You just clean off what you had on before. Glue it to your finger. Clean off what you had before and puts it put down something new. So if they're interested, I'll if they're interested, just type in the word club. And yes, if you are in. interested, if you want more information about club or if you're ready to sign up, type in club in the comments and you'll get a link. If you would rather, I just, if you rather just talk to me about it, you can just tell me, contact me about club and I will, I will get in touch with you. I've got a couple other things I want to tell you about too. Okay, so that's club. You'll love it. You get a brand new transfer every month. Hey, Patty. And so that's awesome. So that's all about club. Some other specials that just dropped today. Um, woo hot glue, hot glue. Where am I going to put that? Um, that just dropped today. Uh, the company is offering, and this is an amazing bargain. If you like to chop and you want to get yourself some transfers, not wanting to stick. You want to get yourself some transfers to start with. They are releasing a mystery pack. It contains 10 transfers of various sizes from the five by seven all the way up to the 18 by 18. So A, B, C, and D sizes and 10 of them, and they are retired transfers. So you cannot, you cannot purchase them separately. And they said these are not the ones that they had a hard time getting rid of. They are just ones that inventory is so low on them that it's not worth them keeping on the books, so to speak. So they retire it and then the, the remaining inventory they, ha they have used to package up to offer this bundle. So anyway, it's a 200, over $200 value retail price and it's 50% off. So you can get 10 transfers at 50% off of retail, which is awesome. You don't get to pick them. They pick them for you, but they have great transfers. Another great thing about that is if you want that side. Sorry. If you purchase the mystery kit, it qualifies you. Your, your total will be enough that it qualifies you to get two free additional transfers from the Creative Kickstart. And that is the one with um, Dream, Explore, Discover, and then the bugs, the little etched bugs. So basically you'd be getting 12 transfers. So that's an awesome deal. If that's something you're interested in, um, you can type the word mystery in the comments and you'll get the link to that. Okay, I think we are done. So you can type in club for club information, mystery for mystery. Good night, Patty. Um, mystery for the mystery bundle. And then I've got, I have a paste and ink sale, a mid-year mid paste and ink sale going on. This is my public page, so I can't give you the prices here. 
but if you comment sale, you'll get the link to the sale. You'll see what the prices are. So all in stock, paste and ink, I'm offering on sale. So this is a good time for you to stock up and get yourself some colors. So check that out. Type in sale if you're interested or go over to the VIP page. If you're not a member of a VIP group, it's absolutely free. Just type in VIP and we'll get you signed up. Okay, so here is, here is our project for tonight. It's a little ocean beachy theme on our reusable Aiden board. If you're interested in purchasing this, just let me know in the comments. I'll get that information to you. Okay, so I liked this. I love, I honest, I'll be honest. When I first saw this transfer, I kind of thought, eh, eh, but I'm really loving it. I've, I've seen a lot of people do it a lot of different ways. I like some of the things that I've done with it, and I would be proud to have this in my home. And when I get tired of it, when summer, it's kind of a summery theme, when summer's over, I can clear it off and I can put on my autumn decor or Christmas decor, which is coming up soon. We're going we're gonna to have a new catalog release in next month, middle of the month, July 14th, it releases. So stay tuned for that. So I think I have given you a whole lot of information. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope, I hope you'll join club. Give it a try. Try it for three months. They do ask that you stick with it for three months, and then after that, you can cancel at any time. Um, uh, maybe you have some friends who you would like to have join club with you. You can get together and you can have a little craft party. Or maybe, maybe you. I'm gonna say I lost track. I lost track. Maybe you want to give this as a gift, give the club a club subscription as a gift for somebody. So that's doable too. Okay, so Becky says mystery bundle and sale. Becky, you're a designer now. You're a designer now. So you have access to that at a lot better discount than the ordinary person. So if you want me to, I will, I will work you up a cart link and send that to you but otherwise you need to go in your back office and you get better prices already because you're a designer you get that 40 percent off so if if you need some help doing that let me know okay so here's our project i'm going to pose for my screenshot and then i'm going to let you go okay um, we won't be live. Well, we might be live. We won't be crafting for till maybe Sunday night because we will be camping at Deo Reservoir, the lake out there, for a couple of days. Um, if we get cell service, we might go live and, and show you what we're doing. Um, don't think we'll don't think we'll get internet out there though. So maybe we'll record some videos and upload them later. So have a great weekend. Uh, we'll try to post over the weekend, but if we get quiet, no, we are out having a good time living in the sunshine, swimming the lake, and drinking the wild air. That's what we're gonna do this weekend. And I'm going to I'm going to put this up. I meant to show off my little my little stand. Yeah, we sell the stand in the shop too. So there we go. So thanks so much and follow our page if you're not already and we will see you later. Thanks a lot. Do something creative every day. Bye-bye.